Hi guys, I'm Krina and welcome to my channel. So as you all know, I make a bunch of DIY videos but I've never done a video like this because today I'm going to be cutting my own hair. I've wanted to cut my hair for at least one or two months but I wasn't really sure if I should do it because I really want to go like that short and I want to get rid of all the brown ends and ever since I moved to Canada, my hair fall has increased because the water here has a lot of chlorine in it. My hair fall plus the length of my hair, it's, it's long. All of that is just like weighing my hair down, making it look very flat and thin. So basically I want to go back to a shorter haircut, get the volume back. So as you can see, there are a bunch of layers and the shortest one is this one. Um, I'm going to cut it at least two inches smaller than that and then follow that for the entire hair. So hopefully this works out well and let's get started. So first I'm going to start off by parting my hair from the middle and I'll take one section from the side and put it up in a bun so that it's not in my way while I'm cutting the back of my hair. And I will do the same on the other side as well. Once my hair is out of my way, I will take a little section from the base of my hair from each side and I will straighten it with a straightener. So once my hair is straight, I will secure it with a rubber band just like this. I will slowly slide the rubber band down to where I want to cut my hair. I still can't believe I'm doing this but I'm so glad I did this. And yeah, so that's the first bit of my hair that I cut by myself. So I'll remove the rubber band and I'll take each side of my hair and hold it at a diagonal angle at a good tension so that I can cut the edges straight. I will repeat the same on the other side as well. So now I'll take all my hair from each side in a diagonal angle and then I will just start cutting the longer ones based on the length that I cut previously. So as you can see, some of the hair did not get cut, so I'm just going to take tiny little sections just to even it out. I will repeat the same on the other side as well. This was a major fail. As you can see, my hair is much longer from the middle and shorter on the sides. So I'm just going to start cutting the rest of my hair anyway, and then I will fix all of it together as soon as I'm done. So I'm just going to take tiny sections and start cutting it where my hair was cut previously. Okay, so basically we're going to be using this trimmer and making the line even. Will we be able to do it? Yeah, sure. Why not? Or do Try. you know how to do it? Yeah, because I cut hair. So you know how it's like pointed here? Mm -hmm. So make sure like it's even. It's like a straight line. Okay. But okay. how high do you want me to go? The shortest that you can cut. Okay, I can try. Babe, don't cut too much. Why do you I... want a comb? Yeah, I think that'd be nice. Okay, can you get your comb? Okay. That, that tiny one. Basically, I just need a straight line in the back and I have left my sides up anyway. So even like basically if once I get the straight line, I can do the sides on my own because I can see the front, just the back. I, I don't know. So basically how you're going to cut it is you'll take this, mm -hmm. bring my hair down straight mm -hmm. and once it evens out mm -hmm. like that much and just trim all that part off. Okay. But basically, so you know what I mean by the yeah, smallest yeah. length? So you don't have to go all the way. Where, wherever the hair starts falling out of the comb, mm -hmm. you just start trimming that part. Okay. Don't move the comb too much because it'll go zigzag sure. again. Sure. Make sure the comb is straight and my hair is tightly, like it comes down tightly, like it gum tight. Okay. Okay? Okay, so basically my husband is trying to comb my hair and <laughs> cutting it with a trimmer, but Oh my god, I'm so glad I could not see this because I have no clue what he's doing right now. So yeah, I don't think this is working out because... Oh my god, no! No! <laughs> no. 
Yeah, because I don't know what the hell is happening here. Because I honestly don't want to mess this up right now. Okay, so basically the trimmer is not working. He's not comfortable with doing that. So now he's just going to start cutting it with a scissor. I guess I'm so glad that he's using the scissor because as you can see, we are trying to get like the straight cut. So basically he's just trying to cut off the middle section which is pointy and he's trying to match it to the sides which is much shorter. So yeah, I guess he did a pretty good job with this and I'm, yeah, I like what I see. Don't cut it from the sides, don't cut it from the sides, just the middle part. But this, see, this end is mm. so short compared to That's here. exactly what I'm saying. Don't cut these sides. I'm not, I'm not cutting it. Don't even touch them. Just cut the middle part. The, but what I'm saying is, uh, what I'm saying is because this is so short, I'll have to cut a lot of it. What is short? This, this. The end. The end is so short. Huh, so make it even. Make it that length. So if I'm making it that length, that's what I'm trying to say to you, that if I'm making it that length, I'm going to be cutting a lot more. So cut a lot more. Not so much, but make sure it's straight. Just don't be, rely on one hair. If one hair is short, that's okay. But the majority, if it's short, then cut all of it off. Okay, so as you can see, I am a bit annoyed because I cannot see what he's doing and I had to depend on him to cut my hair and he's never done that before. So I had no right to even get mad at him. But yeah, so like, as you can see, he's cutting it a little more just to match the sides of my hair. And I think it's good. I think it looks good now. Okay, so I'm loving this. I love how straight and even it is and thank God that my husband was here to figure this out or else I could not have been able to do it. But yeah, let's um, start opening the sides and do this now. Honestly, I'm loving this hair. I love how this looks. I'm so glad that I got rid of the brown parts. But yeah, okay. So this is the front. I'm just gonna straighten this first and then Start cutting it, matching the length of my hair from the back. So once again, I'm just going to start straightening my hair and this is the best way to do it so that I can at least see all the edges very clearly. But basically, I'm just cutting my hair upwards from where, my, uh, where the back of my hair starts up to my bangs and I'm just going to fix it a little bit here and there so as you can see it's a bit choppy but um, there's no problem with that because my hair is never going to be this straight this was literally just to cut my hair and now I'm just going to repeat the same thing on the other side as well and this side was much easier to cut because I was cutting my hair with my right hand and it was easier to work from the top of the, the, the shortest layer to like the back of my hair and yeah, as you can see, it looks pretty good. I'm just gonna take a little chunk of my hair from the middle and I will straighten that out and just cut it even just so that my hair can start at the same length right next to my jawline. So I'm absolutely loving my haircut and it's not perfect. It is a bit choppy as you can tell but I don't want to mess with it too much because I don't want to ruin what I see. Just because my hair is super straight right now you can see the imperfections but once I wash my hair and let it air dry naturally it starts waving a little so you're not gonna see like all the mistakes or anything like that. But yeah I'm loving this haircut and honestly if you're gonna cut your hair do not follow what I did and if you do want to cut your own hair, follow some other YouTube video that's already out there. But the only reason why I shot this video is because I've always wanted to cut my hair and I was a bit scared because I cut literally like six inches off. But I'm loving how this looks. And anyway, thank you so much for watching this video and hit the bell icon, hit the subscribe button and please like this video because I'll be back with more videos very soon. Bye!